information. Um, before we do any apologies. That's fine.
the casino itself in, in Brighton, the, the license has not been surrendered. So that license still is in, in, in effect in, in, in New Brighton as a casino. The policy would apply to any new applications, any variations to applications that come that come before the licensing authority. Okay. Steve? Yeah, thanks, Chair. Uh, anyway. Quite happy with the report for the moment. Then I, I just want to prepare different members to page 13. Um, and the last bullet point, and uh, perhaps this is the question for uh, Ali Murray and Margaret. Um, the first word in that is reasonably.
it, it's, it's, it's a reference for you as members should decisions come your way that you can refer people as you do with the licensing policy under the licensing act you know in our policy you know um, that you'll have particular regard to various matters that are highlighted in, in that particular policy okay Steve. Yeah, thank you, Chair. Two things. Uh, Margaret mentioned before about around um, A4 and about tailoring the, the policy to the, our, our local communities. Just 503, um, and I realise this is obviously being lifted from the Act or the guidance um, as a guidance mission. Which what page is it? Page 19. Page 19, sorry. Uh, it just says a constable or police force. This one is perhaps I should say Navy Sign Police. Uh, is the general meaning of the act any police force from anywhere? Uh, again, that, that's the direct listing from the, the wording of the schedules yeah. to the act. Yeah. Uh, and then the only other one I've got, apart from a couple of capital letters and the missing S in 9.8, but that's another story, um, is 9.4. Um, I, I scoured the policy and I was, I was trying to work out given what had happened uh, with the application for the casino and it, it was women churches together that objected to the granting of the license about the issue about how officers will do with moral objections, particularly from faith groups. Yes, Chair, as with any uh, applications in the, in the process, we would have regard to the guidance issued on, uh, by the Gambling Commission, and we would follow those guidance in scrutinising any representations as to whether or not they were valid <coughs> representations. You sat at the window and read this thing. Yeah. <laughs> Anybody else? Any other questions? David? Sorry, Mark, um, can you just tell us what? What about religious groups um, objection might end that? It's not per se gambling, it's right. about if it would relate to the, the issues um, that were raised in, in relation to when the casino applied to have their license transferred. It's, it's about the impact of gambling on vulnerable people. They have experience or would have had experience with families where gambling has had an impact on those families, more so than just gambling per se. So it's their interaction with the community and their knowledge of the community that brings them to have concerns. As opposed to us actually having to uh, predicate our decisions based on the industry. Yes. Right. Okay. Um, and any
brought to our attention that people had concerns the way in which bingo was being played in those type of premises, then that would give us reason to investigate that. If on our routine inspections we came across advertisements for bingo, then that would highlight um, the fact that that might be something that we, we need to monitor. It would not be something that we would be going out looking for, um, but if it was brought to our attention that it, it was an issue, um, then we would um, address it in that way. Yeah, the, 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 there are different conditions that will be able to allow that for being going to take place. 
case of that type of question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I will know when I know what the details are. That we're going to reach change. Why then? 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 It would be, it, it could be deemed to be incidental, and that's what I'd have to have a look at as to what else was going on. I mean, for example, um, a very simple example is, is a question we're often asked is about uh, a raffle, for example. So that comes under lotteries. Um, but if somebody's having a dinner that evening and they sell raffle tickets and the raffle takes place that evening, then it doesn't need to be licensed. So it, it's just, I just need to, I'd rather give that more considerable and I know the full details as to, to what's happening in those particular premises, what time, what the regularity is, etc. what's involved in the prizes. So it, 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 it's, it's not always a simple answer. Well, you've got a lot of power in your stock, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah. I think what Jenny said, we've got a list of things that says you know, like, and the answer is still so good. If it assists, I, I will refer to um, the guidance on fingers. We do want to answer that. Yes, what you do, I can just give you more objective. I know you're not coming here and you have a quick look through this. I discussed it with the person that wrote this. They have the occasional finger session, maybe twice a year. Well, Everybody puts their intent for it. How many people is it for? Five minutes? And we maybe give a hundred or two hundred pound price. A hundred or two hundred pound price. Don't say the name of the show. I can't. Go on, Margaret. I mean, let's see. It's getting my... It might be making a lot of money. 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 No, no, I'm fine. I mean, I say, I think it's just already highlighted that there can be a number of factors that might not be obvious to somebody that might take it into one category of gambling than another category of gambling. Um, and I think I would need to have a separate conversation to understand exactly what was happening. Um, again, for example, if it's on licensed premises or not on licensed premises, uh, whether it's in the club, whether it's not in the club. Um, so, and there is, yeah, there's a separate section on exempt, sorry, exempt gaming. So I need to cross-reference based on the facts that I'm given. I would then cross-reference and see which category it fell into. And it, it may be that it doesn't need, or it may be that it needs a temporary, um, what's called a temporary. Well, around for evening, there's a yeah. yeah. There's a whole There's a whole thing out with you. Small time. Right. 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 Can you see Mark? Jenny. Yeah. Yeah. Can you see Mark's? I don't know if it's able to Okay, could I move um, that uh, the committee refers the policy to full council for approval, subject to the amendments listed in, uh, um, in section 2.6 of the report? Do you second that? Is that agreed? Agreed. Thank you. Just one bit of business and done quick. There's a light. There's a license 2003 committee hearing on 4th of November. How many more people? Does anyone have a book next Wednesday? Is it morning? It's all morning. I'm busy. Is this on at half five?